your money this morning. Breaking news. Movie theater seats are gross. In fact, a recent scientific study found movie theater seats have 14 times as many germs as the average toilet seat. Oh, let that sink in. CBS4 Zach Myers joins us with the dirty details. I don't think we're ready, Zach. Yeah, now let this sink in. Oh. Even, even if you go to a movie by yourself, you're really not alone in that seat. <laughs> You've got a lot of company with you. According to Britain's Betway, the average seat in a movie theater has about 1,864 colonies of bacteria. That's nearly 14 times the average toilet seat, which has 135 col colonies of bacteria. And the cup holders are worse. The average movie theater cup holder had nearly 2,400 colonies of bacteria, which is about 18 times as many as a toilet seat. Now, thankfully, most of the types of bacteria are largely harmless to humans. Now, I can hardly pronounce half of these, so, so bear with me here. Staphylococcus are part of your natural skin flora, and they won't hurt you. Bacillus are found in soil and water and our skin. Those won't hurt you, but they can cause foodborne illness. Pseudomonas can cause infections in hospitals, but they rarely pose a threat in everyday life. And mold, which at worst can trigger an allergic reaction, but you do want to be careful with it. So unless you want to be that guy who brings a Lysol spray can to the movie theater, there's not a lot you can do to avoid contact with the germs, but you can take some steps after the movie is over. First of all, you can just head to the restroom and wash your hands before you leave the theater and get into your car or maybe use some sanitizer if you've got some with you. Uh, when you get home, you probably want to take off your shoes, maybe even wipe them down a little bit, uh, which you might want to do every now and then anyway, so you're not tracking them around the house. And you probably want to change out of your clothes before you get onto your furniture, so you're just not transferring that bacteria to your couch or your, uh, your lazy boy. Personally, I feel like taking a shower just after working on this story, so that might not have to happen. Uh, that might just be me, though. You can read more about this study at cbs 4 Indy.com for CBS 4 News. I'm Zach Myers. Thanks, Zach. You. I guess. Thanks for that. All right.